Hello guys, in this video tutorial I want to show you guys how to graph a linear equation or linear function on your calculator. Okay, so first let's bring out your calculator and let's get started. So graphing is a little bit different than what we have done so far here because we are going to be introduced with a new thing called variable which is commonly known as an x right x is an x as a variable yeah so we have to use x also we have to um, come up with a function so how do we do this the first step you have to do is you have to click this y equals so y equal here is located on the left side of your calculator and very top so very left top you will see this y equals it's right below the screen so once you once you click this the calculator will bring you to this kind of screen where there's a y1 equals y2 equals y3 equals and so on what are these these represents the lines where you can put functions so y1 equals here just think of that as being y equals so if you had a linear function something like x plus 4 or y equals x plus 4 that x plus 4 goes right next to that y1 right there okay so let's graph it let's say your homework had uh, something like graph x minus 2 how do we graph x minus 2 first we have to type x but where's x on your calculator x is right next to the alpha key alpha key is the green one on your calculator and if you look on the right you will see this button with the uh, x comma t comma theta comma n right and if you press that button right there what it's gonna do it's it's gonna print out the variable even though it has t and theta in it it's gonna print out x because we're trying to graph the line right so just press that and you will see x on your screen and um, yes so we have to type in minus 2 part so we just type in minus 2 like what we have done so far uh, after that you can hit enter and when you hit enter what it's going to do is it's going to save that uh, formula into that y equals area or y1 equals so once you do this I want to see what the graph looks like so how can we graph this graphing is very very easy so you see there's a y equals button right on top left here graphing button is right on the right side top here so it's on the all the way uh, other side of that y equals so it's that last button here right so hit that graph button and guess what there's our graph so x minus 2 graph looks like this right <clears throat> okay okay now I'm tired of this x minus 2 graph how can I change this x minus 2 graph into minus x plus 2 graph okay so let's do that what we gotta do is we have to change our function right so all we gotta do is press that y equals again then you're you'll be bringing back you'll be bring back to this screen here so where you can fix that up so since my cursor is pointing at the top all you have to do is hit clear what it's going to do is it's gonna clear off that whole thing and now you have a blank y equals line right so let's type in negative x plus 2 and graph it nice there's a minus x plus 2 graph right okay how can I add 
another graph on top of this graph. We have to go back to y equals and instead of retyping on the top line here, go down to the y2 equals line and type in your second linear function. For example, something like what we did x minus 2 and enter. If you hit graph, what it's going to do is, is it's going to print out both of those lines on the graphing calculator. So that's it for how you type in a linear function on your calculator. It's pretty easy but it really needs practice so I recommend you guys to actually try this out over and over okay so you guys can get comfortable with it. So that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any other questions, please leave questions on the comment below and please subscribe for more future tutorials. Thanks.